Okay, today we just bought this one. It's called a CarPlay for my sister who doesn't have a CarPlay in her car. So, this is amazing. All we need to do is to plug in the power, 12 volts. And all we need to do is to pair the Bluetooth and the Wi-Fi to this as automatically connected to our phone. So this is the iPhone and this one also touch screen. As you see the car Wi-Fi, we connect to that. So it's um, a a a a a a a a so eight of the eight so we're going to join that now we're going to go to bluetooth so we're going to look down here we see it now we have to make sure that our phone is not connected to the car bluetooth okay so none connected So now we're going to connect this one and have a pass key, allow. So we're going to click on use CarPlay and that's it. You have to have the, you go to general and you go to CarPlay and you will see the CarPlay unit and then you can customize what will be showing on the screen so all these apps in here that I have that will show on the screen these are the one that we can put it on if we want so you must have configure the general carplay let's text what do you want to say testing the carplay your message to yoshi says testing the carplay ready to send it yes okay it's sent so from this we can also touch screen so it's really nice So we can play music from the phone. So we can play music from there. Or we can put the, um, the USB or the SD card, mini SD in here, micro SD. And then we can play music from there too. Hey Siri. McDonald's. Okay, here's what I found. All right, it's very nice. You can make phone call too. So this is a total hand-free. Please leave your message for five one zero. Well, he doesn't answer. All right. So if your original radio from the car has the uh, auxiliary input, they give you a cable so you can plug it in from this to the auxiliary. But if you don't have one, you can use the FM transmit. So let's choose... Uh, okay, so we have to choose the FM channel that doesn't have anything or we have to use the FM that your radio can tune to so this one happened to be the 95.9 so let's do the higher one and see Okay, so I tuned it to the 103.9. So we can choose the one that doesn't have a lot of noise. So that would be good, okay?
so the mounting is really big so I put right on this screen it is the uh, glass screen so you can replace it so what good thing about this is that it's a portable so you can move this one to any car that you're gonna use okay so instead of using uh, one of those uh, navigation we can just buy this one okay so if you don't know about CarPlay CarPlay or Android Auto Android Auto is made by Google and CarPlay is made by Apple so what you can have here you can make phone calls okay you can play music you can do map straight from your phone starting route to McDonald's okay so proceed to the game drive then turn left and route uh, you can go home you can store all your destination in there you can message using the voice so all of this stuff on your phone you don't need to really it's totally hand-free okay and this one have touch screen so it's beautiful actually it's very beautiful screen and the touch screen is really so one good thing about this portable device is that you unplug it take this one out okay and you just slide it back in it's in the back here like this and then you can leave this one here now hopefully you put this one on the windshield or you can just remove it so you need to buy a 12 volt to so 12 volt socket with the USB 5 volts